I was in fact muted. Incredible. I. This is the. This is the fastest we've ever fucked a stream. That's incredible. I'm really pumping those numbers up. Hello, chat. Happy Sunday. I hope you guys are doing good. Uh, this is probably gonna be a pretty quiet stream because- Oh, thank you for the bits of vile meat. Thank you, thank you. Um, am I still- No, I'm not. I'm not mute anymore. Stop that. Okay, alright. So, uh, it's probably gonna be a pretty quiet- Thank you for the bits of wacko! Uh, uh, a pretty, pretty quiet one, uh, because we are- Oh, I need to fix- I need to fix tits- 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 Okay, I got- I fixed- I did it. I did it, guys. <laughs> uh, uh, so for those of you who missed the first two parts, uh, uh, we're delving very, very deep into spoiler territory, I believe. Uh, I think this game is like 15 hours long, so I think if I push it, I might be able to get done with it today. Uh, what? Wait a what?! <laughs> What am I supposed to do with your relatives sucking them with a vacuum every day is getting boring? Why are you doing that? You're at least, you're at least unzipping the vacuum bag outside, right? We do. <laughs> Stop that. Uh, <clears throat> Yo, thank you for the biddies rush question mark. Can you tell the moss in my house to leave, please? Call Weedo apparently is a fucking pest exterminator. I'm sorry for laughing. Genocide isn't a joke. Um, and you should be ashamed of yourself. Uh, so we are very, very deep into uh, Outer Wilds, I believe. Uh, it's <laughs> Some people in chat were saying we're probably not going to finish today. Okay. Hey, that's fine. Hey, that's fine. Uh, so, yeah, it, it, it's gonna be quiet. Uh, to recap, okay, I'm gonna start going into spoiler shit now because, uh, big, big preface, uh, uh, apparently this is the kind of the game you're supposed to play on your own. This game is at least 30 hours long? That's not what people told me. Oh well. Where monkey? I don't, I don't know where monkey. We're not even halfway! <gasps> Whoa! It's- Thick! My god! That's a lot th thicker than I thought it was. Uh, but that's- that's okay. Hey, that's alright. Maybe I can, uh, 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 hit the grindstone and just do a, a fucking stream until I beat it. Mm. Um, yum, 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 yum. Alright, to recap, what did we find out last time? So, this game, uh, uh, if you don't care about spoilers, but you're also here in the middle of the game, hi, welcome. Uh, this is gonna be very confusing for you, because we are currently, uh, we're stuck in a time loop, and at the end of the time loop, the sun explodes. Uh, and for some reason, the stars are way older than everybody thought they were, uh, and, and we're investigating the ruins of an ancient, uh, alien civilization that, uh, may, may or may not be responsible for the time loop. I'm not entirely sure yet, uh, but they were working on developing a machine that could collect and then, uh, redistribute your memories to you, which to me implies that they know that there's something fucky going on with the time. Uh, and they were also building a, a, a ship reactor using the energy from a black hole, I believe. Which is ominous. Definitely not relevant to what ends up happening, I guess. <laughs> If you look at the screen, you can see stars exploding. No way. Hold on. T I don't know if I'm just missing all of them. <laughs> it's just a red herring. For real? Oh well. Let's resume. Oh, yo, thank you, Sing Dance and Break stuff. I appreciate it. 
Uh, thank you for the sub, uh, Genie. Uh, uh, again, uh, for stay on the title screen long enough, the menu starts drifting apart. What? That's so cool. The expansion of the universe. Uh, I I have alerts off for this stream, uh, as well as my other Outer Wild streams, for reasons. Immersion or. Yeah, that thing goes in a different direction every single time. Uh, yo, thank you for the 15 months, Clizzard. Thank you so much. Uh, oh, outfit. What outfit? Me? I'm not working on an outfit. <laughs> I'm not. <laughs> Chat, I woke up. Oh, fuck. Uh, remember remember yesterday? I was like, okay, so I actually had to delay stream yesterday. Uh, actually, let me, let me check the ship logs, and I will... Uh, I'll, I'll, I'll catch up to you on that one. Because <laughs> I was supposed to stream yesterday, but I need to I need to read some hot space gossip first. Vessel's warp core broke when the ship crashed in Dark Bramble. Oh, that's right! There also, uh... There might be a way to avoid the anglerfish in Dark Bramble, but we have to go back to that desert planet in order to find out what that is. Uh, no, my city suspended between brittle hollows. Ah, uh, right. We ha also have to go back to the hanging city because we have to. Oh no. Okay. Sorry, that was. <laughs> that was burpy. Did you just stay up all night without coffee somehow? It's it's complicated. I'll get I'll get to you, okay? I uh, thank you for the eight months evicted. Thank you very much. I think you were the gifted sub one. Oh, we have to go back here because they built a black hole forge and I'm <sighs> frothing at the mouth to touch the black hole forge. And uh also we have to go back to Brittle Hollow, I believe is the name of that planet then. Uh, that's where the, the anglerfish thing is. Right, so, uh, yo, thank you for the nine months over wolf, over wolf, you were busy with college. Well, I hope you're, I hope you're done with your semester. I'm not super sure what country you're in, so I can't say for sure. Uh, thank you for the tier two Glacian Samus, thank you so much. Dark Bramble that has the fish, no, 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 the other fish, the, the dead one, the fossilized one. All right, let's see if we can... Do space travel okay today? <laughs> uh, I think first thing on the menu, uh, just because it's really close, I would like to... Oh, it's doing the thing. One sec. This, this has happened like every time. There's a bug where you can't lock on until you unplug and reconfigure. <laughs> Thank you for the brush. Unplug and replug your controller and just give me one moment, please. Yeah, so how about that outfit, right? Chat, I may have a, an addiction. Um, I'm not proud of it, but uh, admit it uh, is the first step to... Yep. <laughs> I was like, huh, to getting over it. I was like, oh no, but then I'll run out of shit to do. <laughs> Uh, thank you for the sub. Come on, the boy and Ka Karasune. Thank you. Uh, let's let's autopilot. I'm never recovering. Mm, it's okay. So, um, guys, I'm really. Uh, how do I put this? I guess I'm bare. I did lie to you. I think I lied. Oh, uh, slow down, buddy. Hey, 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 hey. <sighs> Alright, gravity's not too bad here. I did lie to you, maybe. Because. Because. I said that I was just gonna be making a casual hoodie outfit. But I lied. You guys know how it is. You get it. I lied. It's actually much more complicated than that. And it's gonna be pretty fucking litty. Uh, however, I got so excited thinking about it. 
on Friday night that I couldn't sleep, like, at all. Because uh, my brain gets stuck in this loop. And it, and it, and it just, like, obsesses. Okay? I, I hyperfixate, chat. You know that. You know it. Um, was there a way to get down from here? Hold on. Mm, thank you, thank you for the bits, Mystic Axe. Uh, you, <laughs> you're gonna create an aggressive Canadian Goose VTuber? That sounds great. I love that. Uh, hold on, we gotta find our friend, though. Okay. He... Mm. You think if I jump, I'll be fine? Nah, I'm gonna go down the tower. I'm a better safe than sorry. Unless... Unless I can't. Yeah, no, it's it's not not going to be lewd, but it is going to be very cute. Uh, I, I, I prefer a more wholesome approach anyways. Uh, shit, chat, how do I get down? <laughs> Jump! Okay, alright, I'm, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. <laughs> but there's a, there's a black hole underneath me. Okay, no, it'll be fine. Even if I fall, I'll just uh, lasso myself around. Space lasso. Space slingshot. Alright, let's go. Oh, fuck. Oh. <gasps> <gasps> Perfect! Look at that! As cute as a time- we say- I say- I said something in Spanish, but I didn't pronounce it right, but we didn't have the heart to tell you! <laughs> Wait, what, what, what was it? <laughs> no, don't- don't tell me. Don't tell me. It, 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 it's cute when I say words wrong, right? Right? Okay. I'm just, ah. <laughs> just just don't correct me, okay? I need this. Mm. Hmm. Okay, I think we're going the right direction. I'm not 100% on that, but uh, I, I definitely don't think I've been up here is the thing. It's very cute. Okay. Fuck, what was I saying, chat? The hoodie. Yeah, no, I, I, I got such, a, such an adrenaline spike from, like, doing something, like, making something, that I just couldn't sleep Friday night, so I had to call off stream. And then to- and then last night, chat? Last night I was up until like 3 a.m. just not sleeping, and then I woke up at 7. I'm like... How do I stop? How do I stop? How do I make my bees go to sleep? It's a nightmare. Okay. What do you think? Should I jump slow down with the uh, the jetpack? Yeah, people say melatonin, but I actually had a really bad experience with melatonin one time. Uh, okay. <laughs> this is so dangerous. <laughs> it's fine if we die. Activate elevator first. What? what? Elevator? <gasps> Holy shit! Holy shit! <laughs> I have a fucking microscopic brain! <clears throat> My apologies. Uh, okay. Yeah, okay, one time, uh, because I actually used to take melatonin a lot. Uh, like when I was a teenager. Oh, hello, is my friend here? Should I go say hi? No, we've already spoken to him a few times. I gotta get up there. And then there was one week chat where uh, my tolerance to melatonin completely plateaued and I straight up could not sleep for like a week. 
like it, it was it was stressful non sleeping too. It was like like my brain felt like it was on fire, and and, and I like I changed where I slept to see if the environment would do anything to help, and and and, and, and like nothing nothing worked until what? Like, it, it, nothing fixed it until I stopped trying to take sleep sleep supplements, like melatonin or whatever the fuck herbal shit my granola mother was trying to give me. <laughs> Alright, so we did explore a little bit of the city last time, but we didn't end up getting very far because we ran out of time. I live a wild life. I don't know if I do, man. I'm gonna be honest. What worked best for me was heavy rain sounds or fireplace sounds. Yeah, noise Noise sometimes works for me. I got really desperate last night, so I put on, like, whatever random-ass video essay, but then I started paying too much attention to it. Ugh! Did you guys, do you guys even know about all of the cold cases or or all of the, the 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 highly public cases that have had recent developments chat cuz I do <laughs> People like fun but ASMR stuff can genuinely help. Bro, you're so right actually. You're so right. Which, speaking of which, I do have the asthma. I have the asthma mic. But I'm really afraid to- Excuse me? Okay. But I'm really afraid to use it. I've never done anything like that. I'm not gonna be able to take myself seriously. It's gonna be so cringe. <laughs> Care to explain the 4th of July Alaskan tradition of driving cars off of cliffs? I'm a be honest, I've actually never seen or heard of that. Like how the major Alzheimer's medication approved by the FDA turned out to be based on a study that was completely falsified? <gasps> Bro, how did they let that one slip? Explain! No, come, uh, come, come on. Money? I guess so, but like lawsuits are uh, very, very expensive. <laughs> uh, especially lawsuits that, you know, like, I mean, Alzheimer's can be fatal. <laughs> like, uh, that's not funny. Uh, poor folks. Can't sue the entire Alzheimer's industry. <laughs> oh, right, it's the shortcut. <laughs> okay, easy, easy, easy does it. Whoa, hold on a minute. Is it safe to go down this waterfall? Is there like Minecraft rules? I'm not even gonna try. Hello, Samurai. I'm doing all right. It ain't even, uh, it ain't even evening for me. It's early afternoon. Well, mid-afternoon. I am very lonely because all of my friends are partying in LA right now. <laughs> Thank you. 
Yeah, FOMO. It's been a it's been a FOMO ass summer. Let me tell you. Mm, I guess we should just go further that way. I shouldn't try going up. We've already been up. They now know Alzheimer's is caused by a buildup of plaque in the nerve cells in the brain. Insulin is supposed to remove the plaque, but because modern diets are so high in carbs slash sugar, it is way less efficient than it should be. Oh, that's interesting. Did you guys know that they recent figured out recent? Maybe not figured out, but uh, uh, they have a really strong theory on what causes sudden infant death syndrome now. Because uh, it's really interesting. Apparently. Uh, uh, apparently in your body... Okay, how the f- How? 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 I'm- I'm going feral. Fuck, please. <laughs> okay, maybe we just- Elevator. Uh, yeah, okay, so sudden infant death syndrome, right? You have an enzyme in your body that is- is basically the chemical that- allows you to jerk awake basically i'm i'm probably explaining this very very poorly but they figured out that babies with sudden infant death syndrome had a deficiency in that specific enzyme so sometimes when you stop breathing and and you're you know you're in bed you can jerk yourself awake and take a breath you know i mean that's how sleep apnea literally works and that's- that's why they snore so much. Uh, hold on. Right, right, okay, the forge controls. But babies who don't have that enzyme don't jerk themselves awake. This is just theoretical. Isn't that the wall you can walk on? Oh shit, is it? What'd I miss? Everything is theoretical. Mm-hmm. Gravity is theoretical. Right? Right? Right, guys? <laughs> right? Is it? <laughs> I'm trying to find that- Oh, what?! Not to get dark, but I know someone who died that way. He had sleep apnea and like six other conditions. Yeah, dude, sleep apnea is a big fucking deal. Like, uh, you you don't like you you gotta get a CPAP. My dad has sleep apnea, uh, and and he got a CPAP, and he was uh, instantly so much better. And also, my mom could sleep because you know he wasn't snoring extremely loudly. Benefits for everyone, you know. Is that- is that a wall I can walk on? Right, it's kind of glowy. Oh god, I- I'm so low on health. Okay, let's do it. Oh, okay. Well, now I want to go up. I want to touch the black hole for- oh. Hmm. Mm, mayhaps I will not be going up any further. Oh, shit. That looks cool. I want to get there. That's the, um... Eye of the Universe symbol, isn't it? This is where they were trying to build it, right? Are we on the South Pole? Shit, how do we get over there without dying? It should be fine, right? Okay. Whew. 
I'm worried I have like one HP and even if I stub my toe, I'm gonna die. <laughs> Whoa. I wonder if that's got a switch on it. Hmm. Be welcomed in this place. The shrine is a space to reflect on what brought us to the solar system, the signal from the eye. We observe the eye signal in our travels and followed it here to find its source. What we know is this. The source of the signal, which we have chosen to call the eye of the universe, is older than the universe itself. The rest we have yet to learn. Enter and open your mind to its possibilities. May I? Yo, thank you for the eight months, comrade. What is the eye of the universe? The eye is older than this universe, so imagine how much it could teach us. Perhaps it is a cosmic library. Suppose the eye is a more advanced being. The eye is the source of the signal that brought us here. Uh, the, the, the quantum uh, rocks and shit are also older than the universe, yeah? How can the eye be older than the universe itself? Suppose it is a relic from a previous universe. The early universe was unimaginably hot and dense. If anything existed before, it would have been destroyed. Suppose the universe is older than previously uh, assumed. What is the eye's signal? Suppose the eye wishes to communicate. The signal is the eye's voice. It speaks a language we don't know yet. Or maybe the signal is the eye's attempt at expressing itself. The signal is a call. Were we the intended audience? Of note, from the signal we were able to determine the eye's approximate age. Or perhaps its lack of age. Can I... Can I go... Can I go in? You said, you said enter. Yeah? Please? <laughs> I want to... I want to speak to the eye. When am I going to play Binding of Isaac again? Mmm, maybe. Uh, I'm not super sure. After Outer Wilds, I'm going to be playing Outlast, which I've never played before, so it's probably going to be super cool. Uh, <laughs> I've also, I don't think I've played a horror game on stream before. Let me in! <laughs> Ever thought of collabing with non-VTubers? I mean, I played D&D &D with, uh, with Tomato, Lolman, uh, Shane, Hawk, and I mean, Lena's a VTuber, but the, the other three aren't. Hmm. All right. Maybe they're just lore dumping. That's okay. I love it. Oh, oh, okay, we're good. Golden baby. Just seeing if there's any little extras up here. That's fucking weird. Kind of looks like a- Oh! What? Am I already out of time? Ain't no way I'm already out of time. Ain't no way. Yeah, yeah. It's okay. We'll just, uh... I still think there's more to be seen here, though. Have I played 13 Sentinels? It's a similar feeling of brain-breaking lore and discovery. I haven't heard of it, but it sounds really cool. Okay, well, oh, hello? I no longer believe, as I did a child on Ember Twin, that the Eye of the Universe wishes to harm us, but it may not want to be found either. In fact, the Eye may not have wishes at all. We have no evidence supporting this. The terrible circumstances of our arrival were almost certainly exactly that, circumstantial. 
I suspect imagining you're special to the eye in some way is wishful thinking. Yo, is Solanum based? The eye may have called out to any sentient species. Or it might not have been calling out at all. Oh shit, that wouldn't be so bad, I think. <clears throat> Hold my hand. What? Oh, okay. I like Solanum as a cringe doomer. I like him. <laughs> I love, I love my incel redditor king, Solanum. Solanum is a girl, by the way. I love my incel, my femcel redditor queen, Solanum. There's an option to pause time when reading scanning. Yeah, I think, um, I think I'm just gonna leave it off, though. It, it's not, like, the game isn't super, like, high pressure. There's 1,000% more shit we have to see at Bristol, I think. Let's get out of here. Come on. What? Why are you locked? Why are you locked on? Please! Stop! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> okay. Alright. Yeah, okay, so, uh, if you're new to this, just because a couple people were asking about it, uh, the, the, the premise, basic premise of the game is that you're stuck in a time loop, okay? So, so, so we are, we, we did canonically die, but we're fine. Yeah. Oh my god, is it doing it again, bro? Unfucking believable. One sec, one sec. You guys know the drill. Unplug. Replug. We're good. Yo, you just beat Elden Ring? Congratulations! I actually. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna cry. I have yet to beat Elden Ring because. <laughs> For those of you who missed it, or you're new here, my laptop- I- <laughs> I spilled water on my laptop. You know, like a dumbass, when I was on the final boss of Elden Ring. So, uh, I, I took it to the shop, and they were like, Hey, we can't repair this. Uh, do you want the hard drive? Or do you want to spend $900 for a new motherboard? And I said, I'm getting a PC, bye. Uh, and I still haven't gotten to it. I just, you know, I just, how do I get back into it from that point, you know? Like, like it's been, it's been months. It's been months. I, I can't just reinstall, well, I guess I wouldn't have to reinstall it. It's on a hard drive. Uh, Elden Ring and, 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 and fight the final boss again after months of not touching it. <laughs> I just feel very demotivated, okay? Have I ever played Celeste? I fucking love Celeste. I really, really love challenging platformers. It is, uh, one of my absolute favorite genres. Hello. Don't throw that at me. Jump King. I actually haven't played Jump King yet. No, I, I think... Mm, I'm not super sure about Jump King. I, I think... It's like... I mean, it's more of a rage... <laughs> Excuse me? It's more of a rage game, yeah? I don't know about that one. Uh, uh, I, I really like Celeste because it has a lot of different... 
a, a variety and like you know it has like mechanics like a dash and a climb and uh, and all of that while still being like a difficult puzzle platformer basically but jump king is you know you you, you jump and you miss because you suck and that's that baby and i don't think that's bad i might play jump king on stream mm -hmm. maybe the hell? What? Whatever. Yo, thank you for the eight months for Monza. What are we? Furries? <laughs> Scalies? <laughs> Wait, oh shit, that's the wrong. <laughs> I am not a furry! Do I ever see a chunky pigeon and think, damn, good for them for beating the odds? I mean, I don't know, man. Like, pigeons have it pretty easy. Uh, okay, not like easy easy. Like, they are basically abandoned domestic animals. But like, they seem to be doing just fine in urban areas. Maybe they're just really poofy. Maybe all of them are like horribly emaciated underneath that. <laughs> Having said that, though, um, I would love a fancy pigeon. Bring back the snail or we riot? Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Fine. I'll bring back the pigeon. <laughs> Wait! <laughs> That's the problem. The snail. Okay. Here. Her name is Bunny. Look at her. Look at her. Look at her. <laughs> Look at her. Look at her suck. <laughs> I love her. Banani. She climbed out of my tank. She was out there all night. I found her in the morning. Actually, the afternoon, because I couldn't find her in the tank. I, I put her back and she's fine, but that was pretty alarming. <laughs> Uh, yeah, you know, she's a, a gastropod. They can breathe out of water, uh, and, and she can seal herself back into her shell. Uh, so she wasn't in any danger. I mean, she would have been if she was out there for, like, a while, but... Now, now I need to, uh, uh, re... Like, redo my tank setup, I think, because I, I need to put my hang on back filter on the back wall and try to get a lid fixed to it. Where are the holes? I'm gonna scream. This happened last time. This is... <sighs> Where are they? Where are the hose? Yo, oh, thank you for the sub, Moof the Moth. It, is this... This isn't a hoe. I'm running out of fuel. Oh shit! Wait, yeah, yeah, okay, all right, cool. So I need to get off of this thing or else I'm gonna get sucked into the black hole. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> oh my God, I'm getting back in my ship. I'm furious. I'm getting back in my ship and I'm gonna find the other ship. I don't know, I just, I swear to God, I thought there were more holes around the North Pole. But maybe I just, uh, I think I need to wait for a time to pass a little bit before the, that shit gets sucked into the hole. The black hole, I mean, not the elusive hole that I'm trying desperately to find. 
I was at the South Pole. Oh. Huh. Imagine that. Oh yeah. We were at the South Pole. Huh. Oh shit. <gasps> It's okay. In this world, you don't need to be very smart. You just need to be cute. It's a bit dystopian, isn't it? Ah! Ugh, no, no! Let me up, you whore! <gasps> say hello to my good friend satellite actually i do believe this will <clears throat> this will slingshot us back there if i can get in without literally ramming into it like a like a moth to a flame okay but i do i am gonna have to be higher if we really we're like we're just slip in there just, uh, thank you for the bitty mister <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> yeah. All right. Okay, this is gonna suck us. Okay, cool. Now, how exactly do I trigger this? I think I... Hmm. Do I just touch? Stay in center? I've, I haven't used it. You just wait? Okay. Okay. I'm sitting. Like a good... Dog. Yeah, I've already read the text in here. I have a headcanon about baby mode. It's functionally indestructible, and you put it. Hold on. Uh, and they put it in your cage because regardless of what you do to it, it refuses to stop existing. True. Mm -hmm. And it provides me with much needed stimulus because I am but a zoo animal. I'm sorry, I lost patience. Do I need to touch touch you? Okay, that is that is glass. Okay. <laughs> All right. Maybe that'll do it. Can I can I leave? Are you supposed to look up while standing on it? Are you? Yo, have a good one, comrade. You know? Oh! Yeah! Yeah, baby! Okay. You guys are right, I just had to be patient. I need to get back into Age of Empires. Aw. May I? No? Do you have a switch? Have I read this? 
<clears throat> to our friends on Brittle Hollow, I just worked here from the White Hole Station on the other side of Brittle Hollow's Black Hole. Our design worked. We've successfully recreated warp travel. <clears throat> I don't know how close it is to Anon Anana's original design, but as long as what we've built works, then I'm delighted. Wait, this can't be correct. Clary, have you seen these readings? If they were accurate, they would violate causality. There must be an equipment error somewhere. I'm returning to the White Hole Station. If you and Root meet me there, we can run a full diagnostic and hopefully locate the problem. Don't tell Kasaba. This is wonderful news. I can't wait to see the warp tower. It's been a long time since I've jumped through a black hole. Huh. They are bad at math. So, somebody said that was just a red herring, right? Like, they didn't create the time loop, right? Or it was maybe maybe this when they became aware that there was a time loop. Okay, I get it. There's no way to get down. That's fine. Hey, that's all cool. We just gotta find another fucking hole. Yeah, who, who knows? Who knows, you know? I'm just speculating. Please, I want to see. Has anyone observed the phantom moon that sometimes greets us in the night sky? Your thoughts interest me. I'm interested in your playful moon. Is it much like its violent friend? Hollow's lantern. Imagine if there were two volcanic moons. <laughs> Alright, great input. <laughs> then I imagine there'd be none of us left. Hypothesis. There can't exist too much lava. <laughs> I like, prefer we test the null hypothesis. <laughs> Thank you for the biddies, Necrosis. Have a good one. This moon isn't volcanic. Uh, sometimes it leaves its friend Hollow's lantern for nights at a time. The nights the moon circles this planet appear random. It seems to travel as it likes. I call them at your eyes. How do you imagine it disappears? Hypothesis. Could it be a shift in the light spectrum? Suppose this moon is too shy to show us its face. I get it? Hollow's lantern. So that's, um... Is that one of the... No, that's the Ash Twin. Hollow's lantern? Oh, this thing. So sometimes the quantum moon appears around Brittle Hollow? At least now I know where it's gonna appear. I'm really interested in maybe landing on that thing. Hey, there it is. What do you mean? What do you mean there it is? Chat, what are you talking about? It's on another planet? Oh! Oh shit! Wait! Ah! Uh, wait! No! Where's my ship? I want- I want to get- I want to- what, what direction is it going? It's fucking gone! I hate quantum rocks. They make me so angry! Man, I'm gonna run out of fuel. Mm, thank you for the pat. They're not rocks, they're minerals. Well, I'm gonna call them rocks anyways. Is that degrading to them? Hmm? I found a hole. Oh shit, okay. <clears throat> no, up please. Oh, oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> hey, 
Hey, it's okay. It's all right. There's got to be an easier way to get in. I know there was a shortcut. <clears throat> that was on the North Pole, yeah? It's probably enter through the escape pod or the Tower of Quantum Knowledge. That way you don't need to wait for the pieces to fall into the black hole. Mm. It's just the escape pod kind of drops me in an uncomfy area. Uh, I am going to see if I can find the shortcut... In the North Pole, yeah? Hmm. Am I gonna be able to catch the moon? Probably not. Only some nights, though. Oh well. Oh my god, for fuck's sake. One sec, one sec. Great game, but <laughs> what a bug. <laughs> Ugh. Excited to get on the quantum moon. Where's it gonna take me? Because they said it has six stops, right? But I feel like, um, I feel like the second I look away from it, I'm not gonna be able to catch it again. You know, like like you see it once and then you just have to lock your eyes on it, right? Okay. Uh, we want to go north. <clears throat> okay, I think I think I know. You guys really think I'm gonna forget to suit up this stream? You're wrong. I'm always one step ahead. If I ever forget my suit, it was a speedrunning tactic. Have a good night, Weeaboo Bonson. Just suit up when you enter the ship, but I forget. <laughs> Then what, huh? Blech. This way. Right, it's underneath one of these rocks, yeah? <gasps> yes, a hole! A friendly hole! Oh, shit. Okay. Yeah, baby! That's what I'm talking about! Pretty sure I've already read all of these. Yes. Alright, we haven't gone down in that direction, though. Which is what? Oh, wait! No, I remember! We have! I think I... Okay. We're gonna stick this landing, okay? <laughs> okay. <laughs> that was pretty good. And we hop onto it. 
Oh, or do I need to raise it? Ugh, I might need to raise it. <sighs> Whoa, hold on a minute. That shit's upside down. There's no way it's gonna have, like, walking pads on the ceiling, right? That would be ridiculous. It's almost like it's a hanging city. Yeah, but you can build a hanging city right side up like a, a new Tokyo Neon Genesis Evangelion. It's not that hard. Weeb! Everybody's seen Neon Genesis Evangelion. Oh, right, the festivals. Uh, uh, for, for people making their voyage to the black hole. I mean, not the black hole, the quantum moon, yeah? Oh. Have I used this? I'm gonna make sure. Because there's a good chance I just might not remember. Formation of this universe. Okay, yeah, we got it. Universe is expanding, etc., uh, etc. Et Hot and dense. Oh man, I do need to raise the black hole forge. But it's such a long walk back. Unless there's some kind of shortcut. I doubt it. I really doubt it. Go. Oh. <laughs> uh, you didn't see anything. You didn't see that. Don't forget orbital dynamics. Mm. Look at that. Ain't she a beauty? They're trying to make a new ship engine with that bad boy, I believe. a little scatterbrained. It's kind of hard to make heads or tails uh, out of like where I am in this game sometimes. Maybe I just have poor navigational skills. I am not always scattered. No, you're right. I'm a cute monstrosity. I like that. I like that. I like monstrosity a lot more than, than 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 moth mommy or whatever the hell people were trying to call me. <laughs> Fuck, man. and may have accidentally connected to your Bluetooth speaker. <laughs> I'm 
sure I didn't say anything that weird. I used to have a lot of moth mommy energy, but now I have more monstrosity energy. I think I can agree with that. I think I can settle with that. Oh, okay. Okay. No, I'm pretty sure I came from here. <laughs> How do I get back? How do I get back? Okay, wait, no, I go up. Okay, I go up and then left. Up and then left. <sighs> I'm a chuny band girl. Yeah! Yeah. <laughs> I cannot deny. Okay, this was this was where the lever is, right? This is- this, I found the- I found the lever! <laughs> I did it, boys! I did it! <laughs> <laughs> I'm the Joker, baby. That's true. A lot of people do call their artists their 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 mama. So I could hypothetically I were a VTuber, and if I had made my own model, would that make me a moth mommy? Not gonna lie, a little bit worried about my time on this one. Uh, but that's entirely on me. <laughs> I'll do it faster next time. <laughs> that's right, self-birth. That's incredibly powerful. All right, we gotta go up, and then we gotta go around the ghost matter. I'm like Ouroboros, except instead of eating my tail, I'm giving birth to my head. Shit, I, I don't know. <laughs> uh... You realize someone's gonna draw that? Please, no! Please, no! For the love of God! I, I will not be able to share that on the internet! How do I... Wait. Where can I go? come out the other end. Do you think it will? Cuz that's how we figured out the um uh, uh the, the the tower. No, it's not going to come out the other end. Well, then what is the goddamn point? Uh, oh, 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 okay. I'm floating. Oh, wait. <laughs> wait, 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 wait up, guys. Hold on. <laughs> I 
By the end of the loop, most of the planet is assembled backwards around the white hole. That is so cool. But why not the goddamn black hole forge? Explain. Well, we're almost out of fuel. I don't imagine we have much time left in this loop. Uh, it is what it is, I guess. I just don't get it. So I have to... I have to raise the, bla the black hole forge. Or do I leave it down? It doesn't make sense for me to leave it down. Why would there be a switch there if I had to leave it down? And then how do I get up that high? Alright. Beam me up. Take your time, though. I'm gonna sip on some... Dr. Pepper. Observe the black hole forge. I'll definitely try to look at it closer. Honestly, I've just sort of been looking for any openings on it to see if it sort of gives me an indication. Okay, so I am... Too far away from any holes, I think. Wait, hold on. No, 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 no. Why do you hate yourself enough to drink Dr. Pepper? I'm gonna be honest, I'm just trying to find cap- Okay. I'm just trying to find caffeine substitutes that aren't like a whole at- Stop that. Like a- like a- like an energy drink or like a coffee, you know? And, and it, like Dr. Pepper only has like 50 milligrams in it. I'm really not, like, a heavy, sugary drink drinker, though. It, it, I don't like the aftertaste of most of that stuff. It's rancid to me. <sighs> but you gotta do what you gotta do. I ran out of fuel on that one. I know, I know. We're going to a guy who has fuel. I tried your yerba mate. <sighs> All right, I'll bite. What's yerba mate? Hmm. Thank you for the four months home bake. Right. Green tea. Oh, I thought. <laughs> I thought you were. Never mind. <laughs> I do like- wait a minute. Huh. Well, this is unlucky. Dude, okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Has anybody in chat ever had Razzle? It's like a- it's like an iced tea in a can. Um, uh, and- and it has, like, a lot of caffeine in it, and it has really nice flavors. And it, like, okay, listen, it, this shit makes me so angry. Because uh, where I went to college, it was in all of the vending machines, and I have never, ever, ever been able to find it since. White woman drink. is very popular at my institution of education. Yo, what's up, Joel? What's my pity on a flat pop? Ooh, like decarbonated? No, man, not a fan. 
That's just syrup. Can I? Oh my god, it's so close, but so far. Is that? That's not a warp, is it? Huh. How? What? Oh, is it Razzleberry Peace Tea? I'm gonna be honest, I thought the brand was Razzle. How? How do I... Where? What? What does it mean? Yo, thank you, Mr. Cat. That's where you appear from Whitehole Station? There's n no, 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 it isn't. White Hole Station is on the surface. <sighs> Why? It, not to mention the upside down city. I know, I know music is at capacity. It's. <sighs> is the planet inside out? How do we turn it right side out? How do I turn? How do I. <laughs> I imagine if we survive the ex if we stop the sun from exploding um like it would eventually turn inside out on the outside of Whitehole Station, right? Try jumping. That's not that's not going to do it. So is that <sighs> But we're not going to be able to survive that. Like, the sun's just going to explode before it's it turned inside out. <sighs> Alright. Yep, we'll investigate other planets. <clears throat> Alright, yeah, hey, let's jump. <laughs> Why not? Fuck it. <laughs> Woo! Oh. Isn't that a view? That is goddamn beautiful. <sighs> okay, we're gonna put that aside from now. I don't know how this is gonna work, but eventually we're gonna have to find some kind of teleporter. Or something that I guess just inverts us in space-time? I don't- I don't know. <laughs> but, 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 but. Ain't it beautiful, Liana? What? Okay, so this is what's going on. I also really want to follow that at some point. Yeah, there was a switch to lower the forge, but I'm pretty sure uh, it was lowered, and then I raised it, and the, the, the way to get to it uh, is <laughs> too too much for my brain, I think. Uh, wait, hold on. Can I not see the map? Okay, I can't see the map. Quantum moon. The Nomaya Brittle Hollow observed a phantom moon that would sometimes appear in the sky. North Pole of Brittle Hollow is covered in snow and ice. There's a uniquely shaped Nomai ruin. They were able to warp here from the Whitehall Station. This is where they first recreated warp technology. Every Nomai warp tower is tuned to a specific astral body. <sighs> I'm brain blasting! I don't get it. your apartment. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay. So here's-
here's what's going on. We have to go back. To Ember Twin. Yeah. We should go back to Ember Twin. And we have to explore the, uh, that underground city a bit more, I think. I, I, what we're gonna do, I imagine, is we're gonna get through that, we're gonna find out how to get past those anglerfish, and then we're gonna go to, uh, that super, super cursed planet. You genuinely love my voice, thank you! I used to not like my voice. Everybody feels that way, though. Now I'm cool with it. We have mutual respect now. Okay. Come on. No, I'm trying to- I'm just trying to sneak to that pod. Okay, there we go. Beautiful. When I was a very young lad, I would literally cry upon hearing a recording of my voice. Oh my god. <laughs> I mean, that's terrible, but uh, kids do the darndest things. <laughs> okay, nope, up, 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 up. Yes. Cool, so I think I can remember the path. I don't think I need to read the directions. Uh, <laughs> you can clip that in case I get horribly lost. <laughs> right, okay, so the actual tunnel is here. Yes? Bitch. <laughs> oh my god! Oh wow, thank you for the 800 bits, Anon! Thank you so much! Mm. Hold on, I guess I do have to read. So follow the directions ahead closely. Is it those directions? I think it is those directions. Yes, okay. We take a left, and another left. And another left. And an up. This time we're not gonna hit the rim. Hell yeah. Holy shit, do you guys know about, um, uh, uh, what's his name? Mark, Mark Cuban? His pharmacy? Do you guys know what I'm talking about? Shark, Shark Tank guy. Cautious about crossing the cabbage ahead. It's not strong. Look for the tunnel behind the falling sand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah! Caught, yeah, 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 okay. Am I saying his name right? Mark, Mark Cuban? I kind of blinked out. Yeah, so this guy, uh, oh no! <sighs> Fellas, we've done it again. We are going to die down here. Okay, they said- hold on. What if- what if we don't, though? What if we don't die, though? What if the uh, fish fossil is somewhere down here? Because uh, those kids, they were like... We can get to the, the, the fish fossil cave the dangerous way. This is pretty dangerous. Also, thank you, Yellow Griploid. I, I still feel bad that I haven't gone back to Sir Bronte. I hope maybe, um... That's it. We're, go we're going in. I have to know. I have to know. Wait, this is just a- this is just a goddamn circle. I guess not. 
Yeah, he created a pharmacy. Uh, easily the most standable billionaire at this point. Oh, okay. Maybe I do have to go. He created a pharmacy with like super, super inexpensive alternatives. Like, like off brand, like not brand name. Uh, fuck. I think like the only big thing he doesn't have yet is insulin. But you can just order cheap ass meds uh, and, and, and prescription drugs and shit from his pharmacy. Oh my, please. Marketing is legit why a lot of meds are expensive for no good reason. That's what I'm saying. Okay. Whoa, okay. Whoa, okay. Oh my god, I didn't realize gravity was so low. Fellas, um, we're gonna be running pretty low on time, I think. <laughs> Walk forward till you reach the sand pit. Uh, am I? I've turned around. <laughs> Help! Okay, it's this way, this way. This is the sand pit way. further left. Uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. I think this is the one I have to jump through the cactus. Oh, yeah. And I have, what, like an, a minute of oxygen remaining? Very good. <laughs> At least I didn't spike myself. That's good. Why is the ceiling leaking come? Hey, do you guys remember when I was playing, uh, <laughs> I was when I was playing Noida for the first time and I was like why is the water melting upwards? <laughs> that shit still haunts me. I just want to forget. <laughs> okay, I'm, I'm jumping. Juni, it's evaporating. <laughs> I swear to God, I'm actually, I'm actually smart. I'm not. <laughs> I swear to God, bro. <laughs> I swear to God, bro, I graduated college and high school early. <laughs> Please! <gasps> I graduated mom college! <laughs> Don't let you say it like that, it feels a little demeaning. <laughs> Yeah, I went to clown college. That's where I got these honkers. Now, if I remember correctly, there is a spot in here. Yeah, okay, so here's what's going on. Ah, shit. You can't go this way. However, 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 however. Uh, if I remember correctly, there is an area under here that I need to wait for the sand to rise just a little bit and it will push me into the warp. 
But I need to find it. I do believe. Without getting touched by ghost matter. Yeah, it, it's yeah. I have a thing that shows where the ghost matter is. Um, it's just I. That area looks kind of inaccessible, anyways. Or maybe I'm just misremembering. I'm gonna go look at it, actually. Uh, hey, you guys want to see some dead bodies? Hold on, there's one somewhere around here. Yeah, baby! <laughs> That's what I'm here for! Okay. Yes, okay, so I will use the robot. Yeah, but see? Um, there's like no point. There's cactus. Actually... Oh. Oh, okay. You think I should hop down there? We're gonna be okay, right? One of my friends in college was a chemistry genius but didn't believe in coding. Like, she thought the things happening on screen weren't doing it. What? <laughs> that shit is so fun. That shit is fucking funny. <laughs> Why? Uh... Gang. Hey, gang, how did we do it last time? We had like an actual brain blast moment. Like it was pure luck that we found the thing that takes us up. Your friend makes me think of me. Because once a time, I was also extremely good at chemistry. And then I had the worst professor of my life and changed my entire degree. And now, now look at me. A bug. Don't give up on your dreams, folks. I'm a full feature. Aww! That's very nice, actually. Oh, I need to touch a tree. Uh, we're gonna fill up with sand anyways. Let's go. Yeah, I am now a creature. Yeah, but where is the ghost matter? It's not here, that's for sure. Is it in? Well, I can't land. We're just gonna get swarmed by cacti. I'm the most famous moth! Ah! Oh! Okay, maybe being a bug is not so bad. <sighs> Alright. Don't move. Just believe. Is that the gravity cannon? Well, it's filling up with sand. Uh, um, speaking of bugs, did you know the first computer bug was an actual moth? Hell yeah! We're representing! So, I would like to use the gravity cannon. 
I guess I can't unless I'm at the bottom, huh? Hmm. Next time we'll go a little deeper, I think. Um, I'm gonna suffocate. You think I can hold my breath for that long? I'm gonna try. Hold on. Hey chat, want to know something funny? I lied to you. I just like lying. This is why I pretended to be a boy on Club Penguin and took girls on dates. Just to lie. I'm slippery like an eel. You're never gonna catch me out, chat. <laughs> this is why Wolfman cocked you! That's low! mutated blob of a woman. How am I supposed to feel about that? How? Just wanted my handsome Polish wolf man. saw the pod it's it's kind of hard to tell when everything is just a big orb okay yep oh no 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 holy shit excuse me mind your goddamn business Have you ever had relationships that don't involve being cucked? Damn, bro, that's an awfully personal question! <laughs> I'm kidding. Thank you, Rush question mark. I am actually aware that I am, in fact, a Luna Moth. I am built different, though. I have a mouth and I can consume many cheeseburger. Okay, guys. I've never- I've never actually been cucked, okay? The, the, on, the only time I've gotten close to being cucked was, uh, uh... <laughs> like a couple people I've had crushes on. <laughs> but that's that's nothing. That's not that's not interesting or funny. That's oh, okay. So so they so they just got in a relationship with someone that wasn't you. Big whoop, you know? I have however been invited to cuck people. And I said no because I don't engage in fucking debauchery. I 
I got to walk away with the satisfaction of knowing that they at least wanted me to. Isn't that fucked up? I knew a cuck queen chat. All right, we got this. Uh, and then I think we're gonna go like, what, straight to the bottom? No, we have to, we have to go to the gravity cannon. Uh, uh, but I don't know if that's at the bottom. We're gonna take a look around. Paste non-bull Juni. Yeah, man, that's just really not my thing, to be honest. I just, I don't know, man. It's a little personal, but that's not not really my thing. We have to go to the bottom before it fills up. 100, 100%. Okay. How do we... Okay, we got stairs. Cool. And an up thing? Oh, cool. Hello. What's this? High energy lab. 400 meters. Oh, I don't want to go down. Judy, we have a highlight reel of your cuck stories from real people and video game. You guys, <laughs> I hate you people. What? Why? Uh, okay. Excuse me. What in the goddamn? What? Okay. All right. No, no, no. This is fine. Hey, check this out. Boom. Whoa, there's actually a lot of layers. Whoa. Oh, okay. <laughs> you guys have any trees over here? What the fuck? Um. What is that? What is that? Whoa! Thank you for the bit, Angel. Okay, we can do this. We have three minutes. Two minutes, probably. Gravity is 0.6. Cool. <laughs> Hell yeah. Christ, what the hell is this? Records show that Nomai arriving at the warp receiver on Brittle Hollow very slightly before departing from the White Hole Station. Raimi and I are devising an experiment to test if this is a real phenomenon or a simple machine error. Very slightly before de Oh, that's weird. In theory, what we want to try to reproduce is a negative amount of time elapsing between something entering a black hole and exiting the white hole at its destination. Initial things first, our experiment setup will first pair a black hole, a small black hole, with a small white hole to mimic the setup on the white hole station. Hypothesis, it is possible for an object to exit a white hole before entering the corresponding black hole. 
I'm gonna throw up if you keep talking like that. Oh my god, I feel nauseous. <laughs> An update. Our experiment here reproduced the anomaly in arrival and departure times. But Pi is unconvinced it's more than an equipment error. I hope to strengthen the effect to render it visible to the unaided eye. To that end, we've decided to try adding more energy. I imagine the Sunless City's energy supply should prove sufficient. Of note, Raimi, Yura requests that we let him know before we reroute energy to the experiment. All available energy has been re- is it rerouted? It is rerouted. From the city to our experiment, Romy and I are about to run a new test. One time at a bus stop, I got cussed out by a guy who looked like Romy Malik, Like, basically a doppelganger. Just, like, a little shorter. Hypothesis confirmed. Hypothesis confirmed. I saw it. Pi saw it. Hypothesis confirmed. This is beyond extraordinary. This changes everything. What a beautiful day for the intersection of abstract theory and practical application. Uh, I I don't like it. <laughs> what is this? I don't know what this is going to do, but I'm scared. Have a good night, Deke. Yeah, I know I know white holes are purely theoretical. But that's what makes it fun. Because if it's theoretical, you can still play with it. Because it still has that, like, mystery about it that makes it compelling. The Ash Twin Project will be one of our biggest undertakings, metaphorically and physically. To build it, we need a way to travel quickly between Ash Twin and each location that holds crucial project materials. What if we use warp towers, like the one we have on Whitehall Station? Yes, please! Of note, each tower on Ash Twin will warp to a different planet. My gratitude to those who noted my imprecise language. Yes, the sun is not a planet. I believe this has been sufficiently clarified. Kindly stop reminding me. <laughs> We can design each tower to visually reflect its warp destination. The Giant Deep's Tower, Giant's Deep Tower, for instance, could resemble a cyclone. We could model the Timber Hearth Tower after a geyser mountain. Poke Root and I can work on this immediately in the Black Hole Forge. This will keep us busy. Oh! Yeah, that's what that- no warping to the sun. That's what it means. The Southern Observatory is asking if creating a 22 minute interval is possible- <gasps> You didn't. That is to actually have something arrive 22 minutes before it is actually sent through the warp. <sighs> what does it mean? We've learned that the negative interval of time between departure and arrival can be increased by adding more energy to the warp core. Problematically, the energy required to extend the interval increases at an exponential rate. Hypothesis. Creating a 22 minute long interval is possible, but we are currently unable to generate the necessary energy. Ramey and I believe it would be necessary to invent a new method of producing energy, a thrilling but enormous undertaking. We would also require advanced warp technology able to handle such energy. We would also likely need an enormous space... <laughs> enormous space... to fit these proposed new energy and warp technologies together. The only location large enough would be Ash Twin. Ash Twin? The energy's currently unavailable, you say. You're a Gas? Pi? <laughs> My pun was unintended, Remy, so I believe it's you who's aeriform. Nerd-ass goats. <laughs> we turned something on, huh? Yo, have a good one, BMC! Enjoy! So, all of these warp gates... And what they were building to test are on Ash Twin. I don't, 
don't know. We've been to Ash Twin. It was pretty unremarkable. Can we see Bunny again? Yeah, we. Yeah, you can see Bunny again. <laughs> Sorry, wrong. <laughs> Bunny. <laughs> How many times? I don't name these. I have Media Source 2 and Media Source 3 right next to each other. Ooh, what is it doing? Can I? Okay. Mm. Do something. Throw the- oh, throw the pro. Oh, yeah, sure. Oh! Hell yeah. That's cool as hell. Okay. You know what I must do. is just uh yeah that's just that okay only black toy pairings hmm. you need to match them what do you mean match them okay I, I wonder if the the side being opaque means something you know uh Probably not. Oh yeah, no, it just turns. I I know it's not gonna do anything. I'm just kinda curious. Already holding Yeah, 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 whatever. You're gonna put your stupid warp cores on the floor. Take that, nerd ass goats. Okay, I figured nothing would happen. I was just kind of curious. It's the, the, the scientific experience. Is that it, though? Is that it? That can't be it. a lot earlier that- oh! That was earlier that time. Can you grab the launch scout before it enters the black hole but after it emerges? I was thinking about- I just- 
don't think I can... Yeah. It doesn't seem like it. Wait. What? Oh god, I need to sneeze. <sighs> so... I feel like I'm missing something. Because people are losing their shit right now. But it's like... <laughs> but I don't actually have... Okay, uh, no, okay, I got confused. I thought I was holding the scout, but... Bro, I am deeply perplexed. Uh, like, I, I don't, I don't, it's not that I don't, <sighs> fucking sand. Like, <sighs> like, it's cool. Like, like, y yeah, okay, cool. We, we found time travel, but I'm missing a big thing and I don't fucking get it. I don't get it, chat. Time travel's pretty litty though. Let me out. I want to watch the sun die. We can- we can turn emote only off. It's fine. It's okay. Either way, I'm gonna have to come back here, I think. I just, like, uh, I, I know- I know the rule is, like, no backseating, but if I- if I miss something really, really, really cool, I do want to see what the really, really cool thing is, <laughs> you know? Whoa, I'm in orbit! Holy shit, I'm in orbit! Dude, I gotta do this more often. Okay, can you explode already? Like, should I just go drown myself in the sand? I don't think we can do anything else here. I guess maybe we could go to the shelled out, um, oh my god, our ship is so far. Shelled out Ash Twin. Yeah, 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 whatever. Alright, where's my fuel? Thank you. 
We're gonna go check it out. I don't know if we're gonna have enough time to see a lot. Oh, I see you're not letting me lock on. Right. Actually, I'm gonna pause while I replug my controller. I just wanna be careful about this one because we don't have a whole lot of time on this loop left. Yep, okay, face first. Perfect. <laughs> Dude, this is nice. This looks like something I would build in Minecraft. <laughs> Wait, where's this go? Um, Perth, probably, right? How do I, do I just, there we go, okay. <laughs> Okay. All right. I think locking with the keyboard also solves that bug. Oh yeah, I remember. So, okay. So now I guess we essentially have fast travel in big air quotes, but, but they only, like it takes a while for them to become uncovered. Oh! Hey, that's cool. We were gonna go out anyways. Huh. That's on me. I'm gonna be honest. What the fuck is ghost matter? We don't really know yet. I'm sure it has some function, right? It's not just an ambiguously evil uh, uh, hazard to make <laughs> moving around more difficult, right? <laughs> it's spooky. Dude, what if it actually is ghosts? Ooh. What if that's why we can hear that guy with the harmonica? Because he's become ghost matter. What, harmonica? Oh, if you weren't here for the last couple parts, so there's something really, really unsettling uh, that makes me want to throw up if I even think about it. Uh, but let me lock on really quickly. Uh, I think we have a little bit more to explore in Ember Twin. Okay, so I have this machine, a signal scope. That lets me, um, like, I can hear the NPCs, like, playing on instruments because they're just bored or whatever. And there was this one guy that played the harmonica, but he disappeared. I think he died? Uh, but, but, like, a couple weeks later, people heard his harmonica again on Timber Hearth. Uh, but nobody really knows where it is coming from. It's just, it's just unsettling. Look at Thorn Hollow. Uh, hold on. Is that Thorn Hollow? Oh! Is it also- Yeah, so here's another fucked up thing, is that the harmonica's coming from multiple places as well. Like, I heard it inside the sun at some point. Maybe he isn't dead? I don't know about that one. Uh, honestly, my- my- Running theory with my limited understanding of what is going on is that he somehow just got lost in space time. So he's just like nowhere, but also everywhere, you know? 
Oh, I'm gonna hit the sun. Come on. I'm not flying into the sun. I know it's it's so seductive, but I'm not going to. You got a favorite Pokemon? Yes, actually, my favorite Pokemon is uh, Ray Rayonicles. Renicles. For being my favorite Pokemon, I really don't know how to say its name, but it's the big cell baby thing. <laughs> The, the cell teddy bear. I'm your favorite Pokemon? Aw. I just like my... Beautiful jiggly sun. Okay, come on. I don't remember. Mm, there it is. No, 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 no. We're gonna wanna edge to the side just a little bit. Should be okay. Close enough. Oh, we're right on. Okay. We're gonna be. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh. Calculated. I've improved my landing so much, thank you! Space travel was a little bit difficult to grasp at first, but I got it. I don't even need to use the camera. Parking cameras? Ugh. People who use parking cameras are spoiled. You raw dog that parking spot. Or don't talk to me. She's still mostly bad at games. Man! I think I'm good at Dark Souls, okay? Well, okay. Maybe... Mm, I'll bite, bite my tongue on that one. <laughs> I think I'm not bad at Dark Souls. I'm good at, uh, <laughs> uh, <laughs> how about this? I'm good at, good at being a goddamn adult and paying my bills. Hmm? Hmm? How about that? Oh yeah, that's right. We did, we did kick Ornstein and Smo's ass. Kind of a low blow, bro. I'm sorry. I don't. Ah, I don't mean it. I don't mean it. But you shot first. Oh, thank you, Blizzard. I'm, I'm good at being a little bug. That's right. Friendly fire. <laughs> I'm sorry. See, this is why I can't actually be mean to my chat, even as a joke. Even as a joke. Cause, <laughs> cause some someday, someday I'm gonna be like, chat, I hope your house fucking burns down. And then somebody in chat's gonna be like, actually my house did burn down, and I'm gonna feel awful. <laughs> Oh, 
I want to. I want to look at that. What's this little guy? What's it doing? Pew. Wow, this is worthless. I think. Is there even like a cool message around here? <laughs> Sorry about your internet conquest. <laughs> Literally nothing. Badass. <laughs> Be right back, my fire alarm is going off. I just need to keep my mouth shut. Keep it shut. Like. Mm. Now nobody will get in trouble. I wanna try out this bad boy. I wanna try it on for size. Let's go. Take me somewhere cool. What? What do you mean three minutes? There's trees right there! What? I came up from- oh. Oh! Okay. Alright. I understand. Okay, so, from what I remember, uh, actually, I, I do want to check out some of these buildings that are about, uh, about to flood, to be honest. Hmm. Bonk. But we, we went to a place where there was a big window pane, uh, stained glass window that was, like, re representing the eye, right? Except apparently there was another way out of that room. Uh, I couldn't- I didn't find it for some reason. Because I have a microscopic little brain. Oh. Hey, you guys want to see a dead kid? I'm sorry. This is fucked up. Okay, fossil fish. <laughs> I'm sorry. Stepping stone, then up into fossil. Man. Was he trying to climb through the grate? I just don't understand how these people died. Because uh, two of them were in a bed looking at each other. Um. But some of them were in motion. Like, that kid was trying to leave uh, out a grate. Uh, and more people were just, like, sitting around. I guess they maybe could have starved to death in a way. I just don't get it. Well... Mm, let's go up. I figured it out! Luna moths aren't allowed to have mouths because this is what <laughs> happens when they're allowed to speak? Holy shit! <laughs> Find some aloe vera shit. <laughs> okay. We want to go up? up. You know what I need to rig? I don't know how I would do this, but I, uh, like, like I bite my lip when I'm thinking or when I'm like, or when I'm like focusing on something. <laughs> wow, that was super redundant. Nice one, Junie. Um, <laughs> like going up through a hole. Just a big chomp. It's just a weird habit, I guess. No! 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 <laughs> I was flying. I 
I guess it's kind of because I might have a fixation. Okay, don't- no- no horny posting. Please. I beg you. I have- <laughs> I- Cause I- I also will, like, chew the fuck out of pens and stuff. It's- it's bad. I just, uh, I just got a bite. <laughs> Can we squeeze in? We're gonna be really, really careful. Okay. Hey, that wasn't so bad. Oh, I, oh, oh, oh. Can I read you, please? All oh, right, huh. This was the gravity cannon. This is just gonna spit us out at the surface. Boring. We've already been there. Oh! Wait, this is, um... Okay, I see on the ceiling there was the eye symbol. Do I ever chew the cords on hoodies? Actually, no. Uh, I did when I was really young. But that's not really my preferred texture. <laughs> To be honest. <laughs> that explains a lot about me. What do you what do you mean? I'm just a I, I just I just like chew toys, okay? I'm a, a feisty little guy, alright? So, okay, so what I think is gonna happen is this is gonna fill with sand. But as it's filling with sand, I'm gonna be able to get in there and then it'll push me up there. Yeah? I think that's what's gonna happen. I think the sand, I know the cam, I know the camera. And it's gonna show me that there's ghost matter. What? There we go. All right, so it already got covered. Cool. We're brain, brain blasting. Okay. At the end of this, you'll have a big old laugh about this playthrough. <laughs> Probably. I, I imagine as somebody who has already played the game, watching me gracefully fumble through it has been, I don't know, illuminating, <laughs> frustrating. <laughs> Somebody said there was a hole. We already saw the eye. Hmm, hole. Hmm, hole. There's no hole. Wait. Oh, camouflage. Hmm. I think we've seen, I don't know. I think we may have seen all there is to see in the desert. Oh, actually I'm just kind of, well, let's just, let's, let's just go check it out. I, I know it's just the gravity cannon, Thank you, Clizzard. I'm having a good time, too. This is- this game is super, super cool. Is there a way to use the gravity cannon? Do I just have to be here super, super early so that I can slip in here? Or... Cuz the- yeah, I still haven't found the thing the kids were talking about. Even though I tried- oh god. I wonder if that hole's a faster way to get into the city. Oh. Oh, I'm critical. Hmm. You know? I wonder. Alright, can you explode? Thank you. 
Yeah, I'm definitely gonna go take a look at the rumors. Uh, I think, actually, you know what? We're pretty much not gonna be able to do anything. What? We're pretty much not gonna be... I'm gonna go read some gossip. No, this gossip. Yeah, I could just fly into the sun, but I think I would make better use of my time investigating. So now my plan to construct technology capable of producing a 22 minute negative time interval on Ash Twin, every memory recorded by a- oh! By a no, my statue is transmitted to a corresponding storage unit within Ash Twin. <sighs> okay. What? Okay. Successfully reproduced the temporal anomaly first absorbed. They discovered they could increase the negative time interval between arrival and departure by adding energy. They wanted to know if a 22 minute negative time interval was possible. They concluded it would require new technology to produce the necessary energy. So, okay. Oh my God, okay, so. They go into the black hole. They come out of the black hole to their former selves are like, okay, here's the memory mask. Here's what I learned in the 22 minute. Uh... Designs for each of the towers on Ash Twins Equator. Each tower warps to a different planet, although many know my were quick to note that the sun is not actually a planet. Uh, fucking nerds. <laughs> Each tower was designed to visually reflect its warp destination. The towers allowed the Nomai to quickly travel between Ash Twin and all the other locations crucial to the Ash Twin project. The Nomai debated building a sun station in order to power the Ash Twin project. Oh, that's the broken satellite we saw. We haven't visited it. Okay, so we need to find the anglerfish fossil cave, like, ASAP. I found a cave with an anglerfish fossil inside, but the opening is only big enough for my scout. The Nomai learned how to evade anglerfish theoretically by studying an anglerfish fossil they found on Ember Twin. Thank you for the bit, Leap Pandas, and thank you for the sub, PC Dave. No, my children used to play a game in Fossil Fish Cave. There is a way to enter Fossil Fish Cave from Stepping Stone Cave. Which one is Stepping Stone? It must be one of the caves that had, like, nothing in it. They were just like, this is a dead end. There's nothing here. The entrance from Stepping Stone Cave is hard to see unless the anglerfish is fed a light first. Hmm. Now my city is suspended beneath Riddle Hollow's northern glacier. I found a switch in the Meltwater District that raises and lowers the Black Hole Forge that we cannot get to right now. The Nomai debated how to obtain- wait! Wait a minute! Wait, 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 wait a minute. Does the, um... The, the warp tower? Will that take us to the uh, the teleporter on, um, you know, you know that one? On the ceiling? The Nomai debated how to obtain a powerful, highly advanced warp core required for the Ash Twin project. The Nomai traveled to the solar system in pursuit of a signal from something older than the universe itself. The name source of the signal, the eye of the universe. Okay, 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 okay. So what we have to do... I mean, okay, maybe not next run. Uh, I'll come back to the Black Hole Forge. Uh, we're probably... Mm -hmm. One sec. I'm gonna read the rest of these. No, my device created to oh, the signal locator pinpoint the sources of distant signals, and my were disappointed by their failure to detect a signal, and that was on this planet. 
Asker's growing a crop of trees. They seem to be doing okay. They've been on a loan for the moon for too long. Look out platform with a spectacular view of the solar system. Asker used their signal scope here to keep tabs on the other travelers. Rybeck has set up camp at the bottom of the crossroads. Their excitement at being surrounded by so much. No, my history is matched only by the terror of the black hole. Rybeck is timber hearts only archaeologists. They ever came their fear of space to explore Riddle Hall's treasure trove of no my treasure. Riddle Hall of South Pole. Okay, 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 okay. So, here's what's up, right? Uh, I, I think we want to find the fossil of the anglerfish first. We want to get to that first. But once we figure that out, we're going to go to Bristle Hollow. We're going to get inside. We're going to flip the black hole switch. We're going to leave. And then we're going to go to Ash Twin and warp ourselves to Brittle Hollow and hopefully... That will do it. We'll be able to get into the Black Hole Forge. It requires a little bit of back and forth. But it'll be okay. I also might want to explore Waterworld more. Oh, I imagine. I still really want to see the core of the Waterworld because it looked... Actually, we're about to... <laughs> we're about to die anyways. It looks like a uh, electric somehow. Could check Ash Twin for warp before resetting. That is also true. Ah, there it is. Let's go in, boys. There's still a mystery on the interloper. Yeah, yeah, but I, I was gonna use the gravity cannon to pull that, right? We'll catch it next time. I didn't see it. It's, it's easy to miss. All right. I am going to refuel my jetpack. I don't think I'll need that for... Oh, okay. So, all right. So, this button is down. Yeah, there's a weird shit thing sticking out of the core. Uh, oh, those are jellyfish. Am I not allowed to? Hmm. I think I I think I got the sucky sucky by the tornado. Mm-hmm, mm -hmm. <sighs> Man. I guess we can't. Still, if there's more to see on Giant's Deep, I might as well take a look around. Oh, God. Please. The gravity here is so strong. <laughs> Yeah, I already uh, looked at the workshop. It's it's fine. Have I met Gabbro? I actually don't think so. Actually, I wonder if there's more things under it, though. Can I go down, please? Down? Like, I know obviously the workshop is there, but there could be more. Oh, never mind, the sun is exploding. <sighs> Man. 
man. Fresh fried moth. Crispy. Many a moth have died this way. Someday I'll follow that little guy. Someday. Yeah, this is a bit like Groundhog Day with Bill Murray. But in space. And less Bill Murray. Why is Brain thinking of Garo Juniper? Mm. Now that I think about it, I think I might have gotten Gyaru art before. It must have been a really, really long time ago, though. I... What? Oh, oh shit, oh shit, is that the- is that the fucking- is that the- That's the fucking moon! That's the moon! What? What? <laughs> Sub Zeth Dark. Why am I going to Bristle? Wait, no, 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 no. We're not going to Bristle. Wait, Brim, Brim. Yeah, Brittle, Brittle. <laughs> Man, my heart isn't even in it anymore. Yeah, I think I understand how the quantum. Well, not like how exactly. It works, but I do know that if I look away from it, it disappears, because it's a quantum mineral. Or made of quantum mineral. Or if I, if I, if I look away from it, it disappears. Well, I sure hope we don't hit the sun. Y'all gotta stop saying, look, there's the moon, please. <laughs> I'll, I'm gonna, I will, I will catch it. Not this run though, we have shit that we need to do. We need to. We need to find, Oh my god, my brain is breaking. The mood is in my room. <laughs> Don't say that. <laughs> I also want to try firing the gravity cannon. <sighs> please, please, buddy, please. Cooperate with me. God damn beautiful. I'm so good at this. Uh, 
Okay, so I am gonna check the cave that was like, hey yo, there's nothing here. Because why would they put it there if there was nothing there? Oh, never mind. This one. There's nothing of interest at the end of this passage but rocks. Yeah, we'll see about that. You guys see anything other than rocks? I only see rocks. Why? Why? Why are, why are they cock teasing me? This is unbelievable. <laughs> why? Okay, I'm gonna, so it, it's hard. This <laughs> stepping stone. There are signs labeling the caves? The moon is inside the rocks. <laughs> Wait, okay, hold on. They said I need to put the light inside the mouth. That's a... That's a... Am I a dentist? You guys ever just like lick the fingers of the dentist when they have their hand in your mouth? I'm sorry, that was a really strange thing to say. Uh, okay, we're gonna find... The caves have names. Am I not supposed to recall it? I caught that, chat. I caught it. I caught it. I keep talking about this fixation. I know I have problems, man. Uh, Scout? <laughs> Is it okay? <laughs> Did I, I think I bugged it. Uh, yo, thank you for the 12 months, Rangaroo. I stuck around for one year despite you putting thoughts like that in my head. <laughs> Alright, we're gonna, we're gonna land this shot. Is it in? Does that- does that count us in? Is that in? Mm. Check from its cameras. Oh, yeah! Um... I don't think it's in. Wait. Stepping stone. Stepping stone cave. We're going to the dentist in two days. Thanks for your suggestion. Huh. What suggestion? I don't know what you're talking about. The okay, so I'm actually gonna explore the exterior just for a second. Just for a second, because I want to see if maybe there's a cave here. A, a mayhaps stepping stone cave here. I'm not seeing it. If I was a really sneaky dev, uh, this is where I would put the entrance to the stepping stone cave. Oh shit, okay. Yo, thank you for the 13 months, Xano. I'm actually gonna hop in. Uh oh. Uh oh, where's my ship? I'm gonna hop into my ship super quick, get some oxygen. And then, uh, then maybe we'll look a little deeper. Nice. 
You've literally been inside that cave multiple times. Is it? Have I? Oh, no, please, 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 please catch up. Thank you. <laughs> please, stop, stop with the quantum moon shit. Y'all are stressing me out. <laughs> oh, it has a mark? Oh. Oh, well that makes it easier. No, I'm kidding. You guys aren't actually stressing me out. Mm, this is just a big rock. Nice. <laughs> you fucking assholes. Well, well, well. Look. land like this? Did I land right on top of the crevasse like that? What the hell is wrong with me? No, we can, we can step it up a little bit. I'm getting better at this whole space travel thing. Okay. Um... I do not think that the stepping stone cave is here. Dude, I'm gonna go nuts. I don't think. Empty. I like to live a peaceful and the fuck is that? A peaceful and thoughtless life. Hold on. <laughs> Somebody said the caves had names? Where are the names? Why- why is there a thing- oh, I see. That was how they unlocked it. surface. Yeah, that pretty much makes sense. Well. Let's go up then. Honestly, it's probably going to be flooded by this with sand by the time we get there, which is <laughs> on me. I wish I could- I wish I could make my nose do the- You guys see what I'm doing, right? I wish I could make my nose do that. Why haven't they added that feature yet? Hmm? Excuse me? Ain't 
no way. Um. If I, chat, if I see the quantum moon, I am ignoring it, okay? <laughs> we, we have to find this fossil. Ah! <laughs> We've already read this. A method to track the phantom moon. So we, wait a minute. You guys did what? Okay. I'm gonna close my eyes. Okay. It's still there. I thought it would disappear if I looked away. Is it gonna move? Moon. It did, then it went back. Hold on. Okay, now, it, now it's moved. Where are you at now, buddy? Huh. Hey, that's pretty nifty. That's pretty neat. I guess I- had I not been here before? Given its reluctance to move while being observed might be a form of macroscopic quantum mechanics. I found your note! Melloray, kindly count me in among this moon's admirers. What is happening when it disappears? I doubt it ceases to exist. Does it move to another location? I believe so. Not only does a moon appear around Brittle Hollow, I can confirm it sometimes orbits Timber Hearth as well. I wonder if there's... I wonder if that's because um, Timber Hearth has one of the... Qua Sorry, one of the quantum minerals on it? Church research notes. Property of church. Clearly, the Nomai were making astronomical observations here. They chose an excellent spot. What's this big rotating device for? What were the Nomai observing? I pause that there's something special about that orange symbol on the device. How the new astronaut's translator tool would be nice to have Andy about now. Yeah, my ship box updated. That is true. Uh, I'm assuming I'll just be able to see that in the rumors, though. Quantum and locate locators functioning. We have markers for each of the places the moon goes. Anona, Burr, and I just observed the quantum moon in orbit around Dark Bramble. I added a marker for Dark Bramble. I thought the locator had uh, now accounted for all of the phantom moon's locations, but sometimes the locator can't tell where the moon is. Perhaps there's a problem with the device? Come on, please. It's also possible there exists a sixth place in the solar system to which the phantom moon travels. You have keen eyes, my friend. So this moon travels to a total of five locations, not four. I believe it's six, isn't it? This could have just been an earlier point in time uh, before they found... I, am I wrong? Am I wrong? I thought I thought they said in the ceremony that uh, the sixth location that it travels to is unknown. Oh. <laughs> oh. Okay. <laughs> Am I five not four? The reply five not four was a, from a bridge earlier in the conversation. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, um, we didn't find the stepping stone cave. Hmm. 
We didn't find it, gang. And I think my ship got buried by sand. <laughs> ah! Oh, maybe not. Yo, it's 95 degrees where you are, Legion. How are my EU people doing? Are you surviving? Has it cooled down at all for you guys? Well. I'm gonna go to Ash Twin. Uh, and we are going to see if our theory about it... Um, hold on. About it being able to warp us to Brittle Hollow is correct. But like that special place, Brittle Hollow. If, if you know, you know. There's a reason we're all up at 1am besides Moth. Bro, I am so sorry. Like, trying to sleep in that kind of heat if you don't have AC is really unbearable. Difficult to put into words. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Uh, slow down there, champ. Oh, oh, holy shit. Oh, oops. <laughs> ah, fine. <laughs> Which one of them? Don't you dare start playing music right now. Oh god. Which one of them is Brutal Hollow though? Is it that one? Might be that one. Oh, okay. Don't you dare play music right now! Please, I have to know. Please! What the fuck is this? This isn't a warp zone? It's not as fast as I checked in with you. How are you and Idea progressing with Sun Station plans? Presently, my assignment is that our plan will either fail explosively or succeed explosively. Hi, you know I don't find that funny. How curious. Rami thinks I'm a gas, and I don't recall requesting that you monitor this conversation. I don't see what state of matter you are has to do with this, and I don't recall supporting the sun station's construction, but here we are. Hypothesis. Time spent away from the station will be beneficial to you both. I'm immensely interested in testing your hypothesis, Yero. That at least we can agree on. Why, why are we full of cactus? Do I gotta find a back door? Where's their goddamn hospitality? Well, sun's about to explode. Um. I wanna see it close. Fuck yeah. It's just like that Mountain Dew flavor. Uh, blue. Bob. <laughs> no, there's a different blue one, right? Voltage, thank you. Wait, there's a blue raspberry flavored mouth. Sorry, I don't I don't drink a whole lot of soda. Uh it's news to me that there is a blue raspberry flavored Mountain Dew. Are you kidding me?
Yeah, that's voltage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. I, I just knew it was blue. That's all. <laughs> There's every flavor of soda. Yeah, uh, I, I tried the peach Mountain Dew. That was, that was okay. Sweet Lightning. Uh, KFC exclusive, I think. Yeah, 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 that's it's peach, right? Hold on. Am I Okay. Gravity is not pulling us. Peach Mountain Dew is mid. Yeah, honestly, I wasn't super impressed with it. I it was fun as like a novelty drink, uh, but I kinda kinda lost interest. Uh kind of like that new Coke flavor, Starlight. I really like trying weird novelty flavors. And I thought Starlight was okay. Uh, <laughs> it was obviously taro flavored though. Like everybody on the internet was like, oh my God, what flavor is this? It's like nostalgia, but also marshmallows, but all- <sighs> Abort, 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 abort. Okay, thank you. Um but also graham crackers? It's taro. It's obviously taro. I knew it from the minute I tasted it. Did I try the gingerbread Mountain Dew that came out in December? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> nah, dude, I think I'm good. I think I'll pass. I want to go in the gravity cannon. What, what have they got in there? Yes. Can I touch it? Can I... Can I use it? Please? Activate the gravity cannon. Call the shuttle home. Yeah, I, I, I don't need a goddamn... I don't need instructions. I know what this bad boy does. Stop that. Hey. Oh. Why, bro? Okay, we gotta run this before this place floods. Uh... Do I gotta move it to the other side? Is that just activating it? Okay. No, come on, come on, come on. <gasps> Whoa! Hello? Hi! I'm so happy to be- Well, you can look a little more excited. I fear a situation may be dire. Hi, Pokenite. Landed here on this comet not long after its arrival in the star system. Our shuttle's equipment heard strange energy readings coming from somewhere beneath the surface. Pi and Poke were able to locate a fissure in the ice on the comet's sunward side, and they descended inside to investigate the source of the readings. Sunward. A fissure in the ice. Right, they were frozen. But they were frozen and looking for something. We gotta go back to the comet. Pi and my sister have been gone for a long time now. They haven't contacted me since we're descending below the surface either. Should I leave the shuttle to look for them? I want to follow protocol, but I don't know what I'll do if they aren't well. Poke Pi, come back to me safely, my friends. Damn, sorry your dead friend died. What does this do? Hyenas are cats. I actually believe they're more closely related to uh, weasels than cats or dogs. Uh, 
Please work with me here. Dude, I love a good hyena. I they're so cool. Oh god. Oh no, 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 What? Go into deep space. I don't know where we're going. Yeah, baby, we're cruising. Oh shit, are we going to the interloper? Or is it just. <laughs> oh fuck, thank you for the bits, Faldini. The fuck is going on? I'm playing Outer Wilds. Is it going to the interloper or is it just going in some direction? Just look like some direction. Well, I know I'm holding down the throttle. I was on purpose. What are we gonna find out here? Probably nothing. What the hell is that? You see that? It has like a red tip to it. Oh, this was, um, DLC, right? Or maybe not DLC, but, but post-game. That's the deep space uh, signal we picked up. It just says three things and you can't really control it. Oh, it's DLC. I see. Well, it was a good run. We got the ship back, I guess. <laughs> um... Wait, no, I... Wait, 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 let me take my suit off. I want to die. I guess not. I can warp back? Oh. Oh, yeah. I knew that. Damn, did I hit it that hard? I was testing you. You solved my riddle. I was just making sure you guys were paying attention. Head trauma. <laughs> Nobody will tell a difference. That's fine. Yeah, I know, I know we need to do the comet, but I also really, 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 really want to find Stepping Stone Cave, and I don't know how. Oh, hey! I know, it's not where I parked. We got picked up by the other planet, I think. Mm hmm. It's like a big sand tornado. Very nifty. Wait a minute. No, that's not how that works. It's the opposite. Wait, what? Wait, what, what, what? Wait. That 
that's not mine, is it? Uh, no, that's Chert's. Oh, okay, okay. Chert's ship. That's right. I think we've already talked to Chert. Hmm. Hold on. Allegedly, I've been inside of Stepping Stone Cave multiple times. But I don't even know how to find the names of the caves. It's pathetic. Yeah, hey, that's fine. Hey, no biggie. Let's get out. Church dialogue changes. <laughs> <clears throat> okay. Cool. I'm gonna visit. Fuck. Shit. Oh my god. Why is this happening to me? <gasps> Please. I know I can repair my ship, but. But. Uh oh. Hmm, that looks like hell. I ain't going near that. <sighs> I feel like that would be such an easy way to get back into the city, though. I know there's a way to get back into, into it from the gravity cannon. I mean, and obviously, obviously the escape pod, but... Is this the character death music? I soothed him. That's a very kind thing for you to say. I think he was in a lot of pain. Okay, you guys know what I'm about to say, right? Where is the hoe? Where's the hoe? Oh my god, I won! 
walked right over the hoe! Okay, we're here. Cool. Swiggity. Swoogity. We might be crushed. Uh-huh. Yeah. All right. I'm leaving. It's a good run. Uh, man. It shouldn't be that hard to find just one little cave. Just a wolf catch a fish? Hell yeah! I think I've seen that in a documentary before. They can go for some salmon every once in a while. Or like a salad. Honestly, yeah, the crunch is why I left. I was like, I don't wanna, I don't wanna live through that again. <laughs> Yo, thank you so much, Mr. Cat! Uh, I, I work very hard on it, and I'm working on more things, too. Uh, very, very cool things that I haven't tried before, so... Uh, soon. Soon we will see. I'm just- I'm, I'm just checking the surface just to see if there's anything interesting here. One of the most expressive models I've seen, to be honest. Thank you! Actually, uh, this one I can tell you guys about. Um, that, that, that casual hoodie outfit we were talking about. Oh. Uh, the totally not casual hoodie, by the way. Uh, I am adding more range of expression. And it looks really, really good. Better just suffocate. Have I made one with ponytail? Um, my, okay, I briefly, it, it was like a sort of half-assed, like, swimsuit model that I made when I was playing Subnautica. That one had a ponytail. Uh, the new outfit is actually gonna have double side ponytails. Or, um, not like, not like pigtails, like Hatsune Miku, like dead mom hair, but like both, you know? There we go. Yeah, I'm bringing back dead mom hair. It's gonna be really cute. Sorry, I already mentioned this, but is the AX merch going to find its way to the store? Yes, 100%. Uh, however, I don't know when that's going to be. Uh, right now, my merch guy has been doing a bunch of conventions, and he's super, super, super busy. Uh, so uh, I'm, I'm also uh, patiently waiting. Man. Uh, thank you for the 10 months, Accelerate. Thank you. Am I gonna keep looking for... the goddamn stepping stone cave? I'm gonna say, I think the new model is... <laughs> it kind of has, like... Not model, it's an outfit. Uh, but, like, I... It's a big, like, complicated one because I added a lot of things to it. Um, hold on. It's kind of, it looked kind of nerdy, to be honest, but like in a cute way, like a sexy nerd way. 
Because, <laughs> like, uh, there's the double side ponytails is really, really cute. Uh, and then I, I showed my mods, and of course my mods were hyping me up, and they're like, yo, this looks fucking great. And they were like, you should add glasses. And I was like, oh, I should. So I added some toggleable glasses. That <gasps> no, 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 no. <sighs> I will not deny, I got a little distracted thinking about- <gasps> What?! Oh my god, that- <laughs> Jesus. That scared me IRL. Oh, uh, like my hair is on end. <laughs> like a cat. What the hell? Sorry, it just gets so- flustered when I think about <sighs> Meganes. <laughs> the glasses would help you see the fucking planet you're hurtling towards. I hate you! <laughs> I'm so mad. Don't e don't ever talk to me again. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm, I'm I'm kidding. Please don't. Please don't actually think. Uh, I actually am very nearsighted. Mm -hmm. And by by very nearsighted, I mean like really nearsighted. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> enough. Oh, come on. Enough so that when I was a child, uh, I actually had to take vision therapy because they were like that fucking confused about my eyes. <laughs> I took vision therapy for a while, uh, which was stupid. They basically just like, they put you in a, in a room and they, they're like, they put a poster at the other end of the other end of the room with like words on it or whatever or a screen and they're like hey read this and you're like i can't <laughs> they're like read it harder <laughs> i can't <laughs> and then you squint really 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 hard until you're able to read it And that's- that's what vision therapy is. And I wore bifocals for like two years while they were sorting that shit out. Ugh. I thought I would take that hit a little bit lighter, to be honest. Have I played any of the Metal Gear games? Uh, I actually very briefly uh, played Metal Gear 3 on a plane. <laughs> um... But I, I know I need to. I, they're probably super up my alley. I did vision therapy and they were actually very helpful and not like torture. I think I might... Uh, my memory of it might be uh, colored a little bit because I was a, a, a child and I obviously d didn't want to go to vision therapy. So I was probably a little resentful. I do remember playing one fun little game where, uh, they, uh, they, <laughs> shit, what was it? It was like, um, nah, man, I, I, I can't, I don't even remember the point of the game. It was just that I had to uh, press a button if I saw dots in my peripheral vision, uh, like as fast as I could. And that one was a little bit fun. I looked forward to that one, because it, it actually felt like testing my reflexes. And that even as a young age, I was a gamer. You know what? I know we're supposed to go left here, but what if we didn't? What if we just checked... Oh, this is nothing. Hmm. 
At a young age, I ran, it, ran into a sliding glass door at full speed. <laughs> remember that video of, <clears throat> of of like a like a documentary and a cat like just sprints into a glass door like <laughs> because of what I'm talking about it's like a bakery it's so funny I'm easy to please you can like dangle some keys in front of me and I'll go like <laughs> No, I, I'm laugh. I'm laughing because it's ironic. <laughs> okay, I'm just going in here because I think I need to toss my scout into this. Okay. Oh. Well, that didn't. You didn't make it, buddy. Oh! Oh, that was a really good one. This one has to pay off. I doubt it will, but but I I have to find the cave though, yeah. Right. It can't be that hard. It can't. Come, come on. Low gravity. Grr. How about you find some hoes? I'm trying! Look at me, I'm checking every single hoe! Almost walking into embarrassingly slow sliding doors is a top 10 cringe moment. Okay, so this is only barely relevant. But, uh, I had this guy on my college campus who was, like, an actual, like, certified neckbeard. Like, he had the fedora with a feather sticking out of it. I know that sounds fake. I know, I know, I know, I know it sounds fake, but it's not. Uh, and, and like, a trench coat with, like, a bunch of belts on it. Uh, and one time I was walking and, uh, hold on. I, I think I might need a, an artistic description in order to, to really explain. <laughs> Basically, this was super awkward. Uh, we were both walking towards uh, the doors to exit a part of the college, and he dramatically, billowingly, uh, opened up the door for me. However, I was on the other side of the hall, so in order to accept his offer, I would have actually had to swerve completely out of my way in order to go into the door that he opened. <laughs> so I just ignored him and kept walking straight instead. <laughs> and I know, and I know this. I don't want to assume, assume ill about this guy, but somewhere out there, there there's, there's gotta be a, a post about how, how like women don't accept chivalry anymore and it was about me. <laughs> Oh shit! Okay, hold on. Hold, 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 hold up. Hold up. Hold, hold, hold up. Uh, I have to get oxygen. We gonna we gonna get a little sip, and then we'll be right back. Okay. In high school, my mom bought me a fedora, and I wore it to school so she wouldn't feel bad. No one made fun of me. I was just pitied. <laughs> God, I actually, I went to college with a, not college, I went to middle school with a girl who wore a fedora. Uh, she was like really cute, like she wore it in like a cute, like classy way, you know? <clears throat> and it made me, for a moment, when I was like an 11 year old middle schooler, I was like, huh, I kind of want a fedora. So I can be like her. But uh, thankfully that never came to pass. 
This is amazing. How did this come to rest here? We haven't encountered others in these caves. I think this is a rare find. An update. We may need to find a way inside quickly, Mellory, because when I returned here to search for an entrance to the cave, there were children playing on the specimen. From what we can see, Coleus and I believe the specimen must be very old indeed. Imagine what we might learn if we could examine it. We both agree it's unlikely this dry planet is this horrid place of origin, especially considering what we observed during the vessel's evacuation. Clearly this hole is too small for it to have fit through. Hypothesis, there is another entrance to this cave. If there is, Coleus and I will find it. We can't leave valuable information undiscovered. Oh, but where? Can't I just, can't I just toggle god mode for a minute and just... Pretty sure it's above, but... Oh my god, if you made me neckbeard fedora art, I would be unironically delighted. <laughs> uh, I'm gonna turn on some light, see if there's a... if we go up high enough. Wait, hold on. Anglerfish Overlook is one of these stepping stone. No! <laughs> Throw myself against a cactus! Where are they? Where are the cactus? I'm gonna ruin myself! Wait, but we still have so much time. We have time. Maybe not time to leave in that direction, but time. Mm, grab cannon leave. Yeah, that's what I'm looking for. Uh I'm pretty sure the gravity cannon entrance is under the sand, which is... Pog. It's high up, is it? No way. Oh. Whack. Cool. Um, let's see. This place hasn't filled with sand yet. What? What? Oh, oh, I don't have my scout. Well, if I die, I die. mean Okay, so, uh, because we missed our window, womp womp, we're gonna- <laughs> Actually, no, sorry, I, I remembered a- <laughs> I remembered a funny clip that I saw on Twitter, but I think it might be problematic, <laughs> It was a- <laughs> It was a- it was like a newscaster that was describing a not good event, and then the other newscaster was like, wah wah, and he was like, Did you just say wah wah? <laughs> you saw that? Okay, <laughs> I'm not the only- 
only one. It was it was posted by like some shit posting page. Holy fuck, that guy was such an asshole. <laughs> but it, it just made me lose it. <laughs> okay, 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 up. <laughs> Sorry. I I have a uh, I have like a dark sense of humor. Yeah, it was like it was like somebody's daughter that uh, that their mother had like put in a cradle and left to starve or something. And it was just like womp womp. <laughs> it was horrible. <laughs> okay. I guess let's check out the interloper again. Because we were missing something over there. Since we have time. Did you just say wah wah? Reminds me of the weather report where this weatherman was like, the UK is on fire, thousands are gonna die, and the main anchor cut in and said, why are you always sad? Why are you trying to be happy? <laughs> this is the news! Oh, the arrow points to how- Oh, oh, oh. Okay. I see. I understand. I know how orbits work. They're saying stuff like, but you're outside, aren't you having a great time? I bet that fucking news anchor has AC. How much money do news anchors make? Probably not that much, right? I'm gonna f we're on autopilot, I'm googling it. Uh, one sec. Hmm, thank you for the 16 months, Boxod. I remember my first day of watching your stream, and I'll watch you breathing lots of mafia and else. <laughs> Time passed really good. Thank you, Boxod. You an OG. Uh, okay. How much money does a UK news anchor make? Mmm. Approximately 80,000 pounds. Eight, uh, pounds are a little bit more than dollars, right? Sorry, I don't speak fucking red code. Yo, thank you, Conquest. Sometimes the algo ain't on my side. Sometimes it is, though. I really lucked out. <laughs> pounds are a bit more than dollars. Oh, okay. Um. About 20% more. So that's about like 60, 60k a year? Eh, I mean, it's, uh, I mean, that's a wage. Around 90k? Oh, wait, that's a lot higher than my estimation. When did I get hurt? I don't remember this run. Oh, that's right. I ran into a cactus like three times. Okay, uh, let's check the map. Uh, uh oh, oh shit. Oh shit, boys. Oh, we're going in. Fun, though. That had to have happened at least once, right? Oh. Riding on the interloper while it's going into the sun? It's kind of badass. Uh, thank you for the 15 months, devil.
Yeah, Conquest, I totally agree with you. I honestly uh, don't know what I would do if I had to stream on YouTube. <laughs> Like, ima imagine, imagine a YouTube comment section just drip fed into your stream chat. <laughs> I just can't handle it. I, I just can't even, can't even look. I like Twitch's community a lot more. I know YouTube has been implementing some really good uh, streamer friendly stuff lately though. Like, uh, I, I know they finally sort of got around to, like, maybe doing raids. Like, they're working on it. Uh, and emotes. Uh, I think the emotes are new. Twitch has a chat community, though. Yeah, it does. <clears throat> yeah, raids. And... And not to speak poorly about the, the the website I'm partnered with, but YouTube gives you a bigger cut too. Shh, on the down low though. Oh! <gasps> uh, Fuck you! The hell? <laughs> Alright, I'll just keep my mouth shut next time. My poor mouth. D did I- <laughs> wait, did I land- <gasps> What? Oh my god. I've <laughs> What a great place to land. I wasn't even looking. <laughs> what the hell is that noise? Stop that. <clears throat> We're gonna make it quick. I know, I know there's technically easier ways to get to the city, but we landed right on it. Come on. <laughs> probe fish! Oh shit, probe fish. Pro oh my god, I need to probe the fish. Thank you, thank you for reminding me. Does my merch ship to Australia? Ooh, I actually don't know. Uh, I'm sure it's on Moso's site. I, yeah, I, I, I don't know. Fish. Is this fish? Fish. Okay, fish. <sighs> Do better. Good boy. All right, now, now we're on a roll. We gotta move fairly quickly. Yeah, okay, yeah, sure, you can, you can click, whatever. <laughs> I can't stop you. <clears throat> I actually don't know if I'll take fall damage here because the gravity is low. Mm, I don't want to risk it though. I'll just do a little, little jet pack. Uh, a little, a little pump if I'm falling really quickly. Oh, come on! Thank you. Yeah, after we find this fish fossil. Uh, okay, no, this is what this is what I'm gonna do instead. Okay, I could get a snack so that my brain continues to produce awake juice. 
or I can end stream and get dinner. But I'm kind of like, I feel like we haven't done enough. I have two buffalo wings in the refrigerator that are just leftovers. I was full. That's a, that's a nice little snack. I started the stream wanting to do a black hole forge. You're absolutely correct. Oh yeah, wait, what happened to that? Oh right, okay, so that's a that's a timing thing though, because Ash Twin uh needs to lose some of its sand. Okay, you go down, you're distracting. <clears throat> okay, so one of those has a cave. Uh, it's probably that big one. Just a double check. Oh, aw, come on, buddy. Stand up. You started wanting to do a lot of things? Yeah, I mean, I also started thinking this game was a lot shorter than it was. I will get cranky. That's true. I... That's true. I get hangry. Do I want an Ava drawing? I would love an Ava drawing. I would look so good in a plug suit, like like a white and like uh, like some black accents and like mint green. That would look so good. Or or like the color palette of the Ava. Oh, oh my god, just Chef's kiss. Beautiful. Oh hello, Eric. Did your <laughs> did your raid not go through again? Eric, thank you for the raid. I super appreciate it. Hey chat, this is my friend Eric. We went to high school together. And he also stream. <laughs> Why don't you love me? <laughs> That's not my fault, man. Twitch is a bitch. I think, for some reason, I think it's only the small streamers that, like, the raid just fucks up. And I don't know why. Is that... Is that what we're looking for? Oh! Okay! Yeah, I just gotta shake it off. Can we punt Eric? Oh, I don't have it uploaded to this scene! Is... Oh, okay. Mm. Alright, I'm not seeing any anglerfish. Or mysterious floaty lights. Uh, thank you for the nine months, seven cents. Alright, uh, did we come? We didn't come in this way. This is a different door. Oh shit. Oh, my oxygen. Is there a tree? Please? No? Okay. Dead trees. Awesome. Awesome. Okay, well, we can get oxygen at least. That's not, I mean, <laughs> not the worst thing. to make it? I do need those glasses, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Did I miss it? Okay, we'll go back in, alright? I don't know why I did that. I'm looking for a tree. There we go. I'm extremely nearsighted. Mm -hmm. It's embarrassing. I also tend to miss things really easily, and I don't know why. Bro, like, okay. <laughs> you, does any, was anybody around for my Dark Souls 1 uh, playthrough? Oh shit, oh shit. Please, 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 please. Please! And there was like, there was like a merchant in the sewers, and I walked past him like four times, and I just didn't know where he was. <laughs> I just couldn't see him. Okay, uh, da, 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 da. that's sand. 
Try looking up? What? Oh! Oh yeah! I'm gonna be honest, those started just blending into the background. What? Oh, buddy, what are you doing there? Oh! Oh, okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I... Okay. <sighs> the little icons that are like, your ship is 500 meters away. They just started to- my brain started erasing that information. That's embarrassing. <laughs> whoever it was- whoever was it- who- who- what? Whoever was it when we ended last time is the anglerfish. <laughs> Rule change the ink. oh whoever was it! Okay they're playing tag. Rule change the anglerfish now has to wear a blindfold and do not peek. Why are we changing it? It's too hard if you can't see anything. Come on. Come on. God, kids are so shitty at writing. Aunt Pai says real anglerfish are blind, so you have to wear a blindfold. The rule stands. Rule update. It's okay if younger kids don't wear the blindfold when they're it. The rest of us will still wear it for the scientific accuracy and to make the game more even. Hey, do you guys want to hear something really fucked up? Uh, me and my two younger brothers used to play tag with my younger sister, uh, like the youngest of us, just so we could flex on her. <laughs> when we when we were kids, like when we were kids. The rest of us, the little fish, line up against one wall. When the angler fish says go, the little fish sneak across to the other side. If the angler fish catches you, you're eaten. Last little fish to be caught is the new anglerfish. Old anglerfish gives the new anglerfish the blindfold. I don't get it. Oh, fuck. You gotta stop showing me dead kids, Outer Wilds. So, they all wore... What is this? Are these just toys? They were all wearing blindfolds? Uh, at least... Hmm. The anglerfish is wearing a blindfold. No, it's- no, it's not. The important part will be in your ship log. Oh, thank you. I was trying to solve this riddle here. I was like, close your eyes and look oh Is is the is the deal with the anglerfish that you're not supposed to look at them or they'll fucking eat you? Yeah, I know, I see that. Okay, let's go up. Oh please let me up! Let's give it another go. <laughs> Please, you mother, you motherfucker, just let me have it. We're gonna stand on the tip tiptoe on the little stem, okay? Mm. Okay, all right, no, 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 all right, we're good. We're just going, going straight up. <sighs> Velocity, baby! Okay, cool. What's this? What's this? Can I at least get back here to read? Oh! Oh, hell yeah! Okay, I know what that is. <clears throat> anglerfish study. Visually, the specimen appears to be of the same species as the anglerfish and dark bramble. We don't believe it originated from this planet. 
The anglerfish's digestive tract suggests death by starvation. An update. Melloray and I, well, <laughs> while I was here making sketches of the anglerfish, I observed, observed the children I saw earlier playing here again. They've added a rule to the game that incorporates our research. It's wonderful. I'm entirely delighted. It's never too early to appreciate biology. The long growth protruding from its head is bioluminescent. Perhaps it uses this growth to attract prey, a lure. I think... Have I read that message? This this one? Yeah. 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 I, I think you're not supposed to look at them. Right? No? Small brain? Okay, like, obviously you're not supposed to go to the lure. I thought it was maybe more exciting than that. Right? What does the word blind mean? Oh. Wait, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Sorry, I, I didn't know if they were trying to mix- Okay, just so that- Just so that you guys understand me, okay? I know- I know I sound insane by saying, Oh, you, it's- You're not supposed to look at them or they'll kill you. This game has been fucking with, like, uh, like, like, quantum mechanics and observing things uh, and things acting without being observed so much, I thought- I thought the anglerfish would have the same gimmick, right? Okay, just as long as we understand each other. Yeah, I thought they were maybe quantum fish. I was like, that makes sense, right? Like, like, sure, they might be blind, but they still might feel you in a different way because they're fucking quantum fish from another dimension or something. <laughs> Like, especially, not to mention, not to mention, by the way, that, uh, let's see, Dark Bramble, where, wherever, by the way, has a core that is, like, astronomically bigger than the rest of it, okay? Like, like, even this implies a disruption in space-time, right? Okay. They can hear with their ears? Do fish even have ears?! Why would they need ears? No, tell me, why would they need ears? Sure, like maybe it's a sense of vibrations, uh, but like... <sighs> yeah, I wanna go to Dark Bramble. Unfortunately, I think... Hmm, we're pretty close. <gasps> Cause they don't have eyes? What do you mean? F fish have eyes? What are you talking about? No, you sound crazy. I'm not crazy. You're crazy. You're all fucking crazy. I'll show you crazy. <laughs> one of these days, one of these days, I'm held together by threats. <laughs> How else can they listen to music? Oh, true! Fish like some nice jams. Wait, 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 we're not going to Dark Bramble yet. We still need to test our hypothesis. No, it's all got gravity. Okay. Sure hope we don't go into the sun. Fish need to be able to listen to streams. True! Oh, come on, old girl. What's the matter? Can't even make one little trip. You know, I kind of thought if I just left it alone, it would fix itself. But I, I guess ships aren't as good as cars in this universe. Okay. 
Okay, we're just gonna... There we go. <laughs> no, let me... <laughs> no, I <laughs> don't. Ah, my thrusters are broke. Anything else? Kind of seemed like there was a lot more broken things. Oh well, as long as I got the thruster, I think we'll be fine. Upper hull damaged? Ha! <laughs> That's none of my business. That is a future Junie problem. Because of the way the endangered species act is worded, bees are legally fish in California. I heard about that. Uh, they were, uh, uh, he, he talked about, uh, fuck, sorry. Oh, we're not gonna be able to make it. <laughs> I don't think we're gonna be able to make it. We're gonna get eaten by the sun. Yeah, I heard that from Fish for Thought. Which is a, a fun channel that I like to peruse. Okay, I would like to get off, please. Please. Beautiful, thank you. Thank you. Let's get out of here before we fly into the sun. We do not have much time. Really, 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 really do not have much time. Holy shit. Where are we going? Where are we going? I don't care. I don't care, take me. Take me there. I love how you never use the landing cam. Yeah! Hell yeah. Never. how the teleports work. I just panicked. Is this some kind of fucking joke? How do you measure progress in this game? Um, it's hard to say, to be honest, because the game is, like, not linear at all, apparently. Okay, don't hit this. Don't hit your head on the sun. Okay. Should I just go in? Should I just... Should I just go into the sun? Fuck it, man. No, I want to at least see what teleporter leads to what. Okay? I just want to see. Gravity, 0.7. You think I can make that? We will try. Oh, yeah! That velocity! Oh. Gravity's gone down. Uh, can I- can I get off? Thank you. Okay. Uh, we're not- Oh, uh, we're not gonna make it! Hell Frost, enjoy your tequila. Alright. I wanna see. Oh, I'm not gonna be able to see! Wait, I wanna see! Aw, 
Aw, thank you, Nuppy Crows, for the coupon. Well, that teleporter didn't go off, and I'm assuming it's literally just because I wasn't standing there long enough. So am I getting dinner? Hmm, I don't know. I want to touch the Black Hole Forge. That's what I want. Okay, uh, I will check my ship. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. And then maybe I'll chase that weird spark thing. I should eat dinner? No, you know, uh, you know what I got? Hey, I'm gonna sound like a total grandma. Um, uh, I was at the store the other day, just fucking around, and I found a Werther's original, but with caramel filling, like soft caramel filling. And I'll be honest, I'm easy to please. Uh, nothing, nothing hits quite like a, a good old Werther's original. Yo, thank you, Oni Ronan. I'm... I don't need dinner. It's cool. Rollers are low-key the best candy. Honestly, they're so good. It's the... Oh, they're like buttery. It hits different. It hits different from other... other... candies. I'm not a candy eater, but I'll, I, I make an exception for, like, soft caramels. And some some funky Werther's original. Okay, so we have a little bit of time. Sorry if you guys can hear me with this thing in my mouth. Oh yeah, we were gonna check... Our logs. One second. That's a lot of things. Shadow's equipment heard a strange energy reading from somewhere beneath the surface. Two of them of my located a fissure in the ice in the sunward side. Right, we were looking at that, but then we <laughs> went into the sun. Awesome. Okay, I'm gonna swallow this one sec. Mm -hmm. Wait for it. Hold on. Well, it wasn't like a Werther's Werther's. It has like a crispy outside shell and like caramel inside. Okay. No, my children used to play a game here. They died. The end. Uh, the blindfold rule was added because. Oh, no, 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 no. Real anglerfish are blind. The adult Nomai were delighted to see the children incorporate their research into the game's rules. The Black Hole Forge is suspended below the Hanging City. If on a switch in the Meltwater District that raises and lowers the forge, the Black Hole Forge District is the highest district in the Hanging City. A Nomai named Pokey plans to create an advanced warp core in the Black Hole Forge. Yes, yes, okay. No mind debate of building a sun station in order to power the Ash Twin project. They built something called the Sun Station, but not everyone supported its construction. Several large Nomai towers form a ring about around the Ash Twins for creator. Okay. All right. How about this? Uh, this is what we're going to do. We're going to go uh, to the interloper. Oh, did I miss the moon? <laughs> <gasps> Fuck! Wait, that's not the moon, is it? No, that's Ash Twin. <gasps> Mm. <laughs> I'm so mad. Wait, is that is that is that the moon? Is that the moon? Is that the Is that the quantum moon? <laughs> 